salutation, much love to y'all. Came out there pushing all this word and truth and sincerity. And uh, we're gonna do a quick video with what's that are fine in transit. Um, we'll just go ahead and bring it out of scripture. Yeah. This is uh, Amos chapter 9. I'm gonna start at 9. It says, For lo, I will command and I will sift the house of Israel. Let's start at 8 then. This is Amos 9 and 8. It says, Behold, the eyes of, your, of the Lord power are upon the sinful kingdom. And I will destroy from off the face of the earth. Uh, originally, you know, that I was talking about the nation of Israel, all right? Uh, you know, the sinful kingdom, the sinful kingdom, yeah, which was the Israelites. So now, you know, it's twofold talking about America. But, you know, we, we're going to uh, hit on uh, the wicked war people, go ahead. And I will destroy from off the face of the earth, saving that I will not utterly destroy the house of Jacob, saith the Lord. Because yeah, yeah, ultimately, the Lord, he ain't going to destroy all of Israel. You know, uh, Isaiah 45, you know, the world without end. I mean, the nation of Israel, you know, they're there. Yeah, so Hosea chapter 1 says, it's the sand of the sea. And the Lord ultimately, he, you know, he ain't going to destroy all of them because that's his chosen people. But they're a, a sinful kingdom, a, a, a sinful people, a wicked, adulterous, you know, a, a generation at, at this point. This is just a bunch of brute beasts. Go ahead. It says, verse 9, For lo, I will command, and I will sift the house of Israel among all nations, like as corn is sifted in a sieve. As a, so the Lord is sifting the nation of Israel. He's taking the good from the, you know, separating the good from the bad of the nation. And the Lord don't need no, no brute beast two-third. You know, so it's just some grimy nigger. Go ahead. Says, yet shall not the least grain fall upon the earth. So the Lord is going to preserve those that have been, you know, preserved from the foundation. And none of the day, like all oh, your yeah, I said, um, and none of them are lost. You know, they like, you know, rough paraphrase. None of them are lost, man. To the, to, to, to the devil, the son of perdition. Go ahead. All the sinners of my people shall die by the sword. All see all the sinners of, 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 of his people. He specifically said his people. He don't give two shits about anybody else except well, he obviously the creator of everything. But his, his the main, um, you know, his main uh, what's the word? Um, you know, um, it's on the tip of my tongue. Uh, concern. All right, his main concern is with his people, the Israelites. All right, Yasserah. That's why he said, all the sinners of my people shall die by the sword. Because all, all these uh, wicked, you know, dirtbags out here that we call Israelite or niggers and spigs, because they ain't even Israelites, you know. You, you, you got to earn that title. But all of them are going to die by the sword, whether it be a gun, whether it be a nuclear missile, uh, you know, whatever. Because the Lord could use anything to put the, these people to death. Go ahead. Mm -hmm. Says which say the well. Let me get a quick preset real quick. This is Sirach twelve and six. It says for the Most High hated sinners and will repay vengeance unto the ungodly and keep them against the mighty day of their punishment. All right, and like the brother was just saying, you know, they're gonna there's there's some Israelites uh, chosen to get nuclear missiles. There's other others that are set to get uh, death by uh, pestilence, famine. All right. And the Lord is going to repay that vengeance upon these people, all right? Because they didn't, they, um, what's it called? Like the scriptures say, though, judgment is, isn't executed speedily, all right? It, the, the, what is it? The men are set in their hearts yeah. to do evil, yeah. all right? And that's, that's the Israel, man. That's you Israelites, all right? You, you, you surpass the deeds of the wicked, man, yep. all right? And you wanted to, you wanted to go a horn off and you wanted to go and, and act like you, you didn't know better. But the Most High gave you no excuse, especially in these last days, man. All right, and a lot of two thirds, or well, the the, the two thirds here in America, they're gonna get put to death, man. They're gonna be destroyed. Yeah, they have no remedy. There's no remedy for these niggas, mm -hmm. okay. except for the missiles okay. and, and all the destruction that's coming. What is that? Uh, so, uh this is rock somewhere. What it says, all, all, all the bloodshed, famine, pestilence. You know, all that is for the wicked. For their sakes came the flood. I think it's a Sirach 41 or 39, something like that. But you gotta get uh go ahead and go back to that uh Amos 9. Amos 9 and 10. Uh, it says, All the sinners of my people shall die by the sword, 
language. And the sword isn't just talking about guns or, or, or the missiles, man. It could be any type of uh, form of, uh, of death, man. All right, because that's what the sword does, uh, represents, an instrument of death. Yeah. And you can, an instrument of death can be the measles. It can be Ebola. All right, it can be a... Uh, 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 it could be an animal. Yeah, it could be an animal. It could be a, uh, a snake. Could 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 be something that you ain't never seen. You could just choke on air and die, man. Could Most like mother. You know? <laughs> hey, just, just look at... um. Uh, uh, what happened with these guys? Uh, the the husband and wife that try to keep money from yeah. from the pot, you yeah. know, from the pot. Uh, uh, in the church, and, and yeah. they, they, like they just dropped dead, man. Who knows what happened to them? The most high might have just had their heart just rupture or something, man. Just dropped dead on the spot. Yep. So it, 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 a lot of you, a lot of you, Jakes, man. You you going you gonna receive a horrible death, man. You wanna be you wanna be wicked as people. You wanna be uh, going yeah. against the 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 current. All right, which is the the, the flow of Yahweh by Shemiel Shai, man? Then guess what? The Most High is gonna have some rapids for you, man. Yeah. Hey, cause that, hey, that like, the brother brought out that example. That's gonna happen again <laughs> when the Lord start putting it. Cause that that was really that was spiritual power on on, on Peter. Yeah. He said, "Look, you ain't lied to me. You lied to the Holy Spirit." And they just dropped that yeah. one at a time. First, the, the the what was it? I think the husband died first. Yeah, the husband died, and then the wife didn't know. Yep, yeah. and then she, he, you know, Peter ran the. <laughs> He bamboozled her and she he dropped dead too. He said, There's people out here ready to carry you away. Yeah, he said, The men that carried, buried your husband, they, they at the door. Carry, yeah, here to carry you away. And then uh, the ghost was taken from him, bro. Uh, yeah. That's hey, yeah. It was like uh, the movie The Matrix, the first one, when they're at the beginning, when the dude, the, the Judas Iscariot, he's on the other side, and he's pulling the plug yeah, from him, people yeah. just dropping yeah, dead. Yeah. You know, that's, that's how it was. If you want to pull the plug, yeah, if you want a visual, that, that's a good visual of what happened. And that's uh, things like that are gonna happen, man. Yep. Again, yep. and it's gonna happen to these grimy niggas. <laughs> yep. They're gonna try to lie. They're gonna think they're trying to get over one over us. And then the, you know the, the Lord's gonna put us, put it in our spirit to say, "Hey, you ain't lying to us. You, you lying to the mo you how about Shemuel Shine? They're just gonna drop that right there. And we're gonna keep it moving. Uh, and two, <laughs> ain't gonna buy, ain't nobody gonna carry you out this time though. Ain't nobody gonna bury you. You're just gonna be out there. This is a quick precept. This is Isaiah 66 and verse 16. <clears throat> it says, for by fire and by his sword will Yahweh plead with all flesh, and the slain of Yahweh shall be many. All right, so you see, a lot of a lot of you people are gonna die, man. All right, and this includes everyone in the world, but a majority of the people that are gonna get put to death, man, is a lot of you Jakes, man. A lot of you niggas out here, man. All right, because a lot of these heathens, the majority of them are, are a vast number of them are gonna get put to death, but a lot of them are gonna be slave for slavery, man. All right, while you niggas are gonna have to get sent up to the to the heavenly father and wait for your turn to get come back man all right so going back to that amos 9 and 10 again it says all the sinners of my people shall die by the sword which say the evil shall not overtake us nor prevent us and that's what these niggas think man they made the most high they, they, you know a lot of our people is atheists anyway they say they believe in the most high but that's a bunch of crap they don't actually believe that's why they continue to do wickedness man and like, you know, you ain't gonna have no excuse. The, mo the most high making it so easy for you to, get, you know, come across this truth and, you know, to repent. But ultimately, the Lord don't want you to repent or be converted, as the scriptures say. That's why he, he put the spirit of, of, of slumber, of deep, deep sleep on you. So that you, you, you can't, you just can't get it. Can you come on you? Our, our people come across prophets, you know, every day, man. Brothers encounter people every day, you know. And uh, guess what? We ain't not converting people to masses yet. You know, there are. It's gonna come a time when the, the masses are being converted, like the, you know, the, in, in the past, you know, the thousand, five thousand a day. But right now, man, people are just brushing us off because they don't really see it. And they don't. They, they think every, what we're saying is just a joke. But uh, get Ezekiel 33. <clears throat> so, <clears throat> Ezekiel chapter 33. Three, one, sorry, 33. Two. First one. Ezekiel 33. 33, 33. Okay. Mm -hmm. This is Ezekiel 33 and 33. It says, and when this comes to pass, lo, it will come. Talking about the prophecies. All right. And, and, and uh, the scripture is talking about that people, the sinners of my people shall be put to death. That's a prophecy, man, because that hasn't happened. Yeah, people think it's a 
joke. Yeah. You know, because they, they ain't never heard that scripture before. Okay. Well, the people that go to church ain't never heard that before. Okay. I'll, I'll say this. It's, it's happened because you get two-thirds that get judged every day, but not yeah. on the scale and level that is going to get ready to happen around the whole four corners of the earth, man. Yeah. All right? So that's the prophecy that, that that's going to come to pass. And when you start seeing niggas drop dead on the streets, this is what you're going to be saying, man. It says that when this come to pass, lo, it will come. Then shall they know that a prophet hath been among them. So here, here it is. The Most High is sending out his prophets to warn you people to tell you to get your asses right. Because if not, the Most High is going to put you to death. All right? Because there is, contrary to popular belief, all right, there is a mass death coming. All right? Along with the mass awakening, there's going to be a mass death coming because the Most High... Um, oh, man, I got this damn garbage truck up here. Let me get some that. But um, the Most High has given you people up to 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 uh, your own vile affections, yeah. man. All right? Their own lust. Okay, yep. it, says, it says, then shall they know that our prophet hath been among them, man. And then then you're going to know, damn, them dudes were right, man. My grandmama just died. You know, I, I, my, my mother's eyes, they, they just popped out of her head. You know, uh, my, my sister got gunned down. That's... Nigga, woman, patting oh, the weave geez. is itching. They can't scratch it. <laughs> see, it just wanted to be as soon as other people. <laughs> no, no, see, man, hey, the, the the judgment is gonna come for you, people, man. And you're gonna, the Most High it is so beautiful because the Most High is gonna make you know why and, and where you heard this from, man. All right, that's why brothers always say it's gonna be the biggest. I told you so because people are gonna be like, oh shit, man, these guys are right, and we're gonna be telling you people we told you so, man. We told you you niggas were going to die, man. We told you that that wickedness that you was doing was going to get you nowhere, man. We told you that 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 uh, um, selling out for, for millions wasn't going to get you nowhere, man. We told you that uh, committing adultery was not going to get you nowhere, but the only thing that's going to get you is death, man. And ultimately, that's what's going to happen to a lot of you people. Two-thirds of Israel here in America is going to get put to death, man, and Babylon the Great. All right, and that's a big number, man. That's a lot of Jake out here, man. All right. Anything else? Not over there. Come. Hey, so you know, with that, you know, he he he. The warning, man. Take the warning. If you're one of those that that are that are out there, just coming across these videos, and maybe you just accidentally clicked on this man, and you're hearing these words, hey, you better get yourself right with the Lord, man. And I ain't talking about sweet Jesus. All right. I ain't talking about sweet Jesus. I'm talking about your how about Shimei Shai. Get yourself right with your how about Shimei Shai. And pray to the Most High that you've been a chosen vessel to be saved, man. All right, because if not, you're gonna be destroyed, man. Right, you're you watching this video either for salvation or condemnation. Yep. So you can either get on this side or dot perish with the, the multitude, you know, yep. the masses. Yeah. So with that, you know, Lord willing, you brothers and sisters were edified out there. And uh, until next time, we say shalom. Shalom.